Hello and welcome back, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, to more Let's Play Fallout 2. I can't hear myself talk. Let me turn the volume down. Um, we are here in the New California Republic, uh, and we have been given a task by the uh, by the Rangers, the, the NCR Rangers, to free the slaves in the slave pens. And then we will become part of the, uh, the NCR Rangers. Uh, which Res Rix isn't really interested in. He's just... You know, he's interested in the perks, that's for sure. But not much else. So, uh... Let's get on with it, huh? I think we should be okay. Uh, my companions have really good weapons. Well, pretty good weapons. God damn. That's gotta burn, man. You hit my fucking skull! Can't imagine how much that would hurt getting hit by a laser to the face. Fuck, man. Still look just ripping through these guys. Thank you, Solik. You made quick work of them. What do we got? We've got some ammo for our friend, uh, yes, I say friend, uh, Vic. Can I get access to these other bodies? Just a question. Got some armor piercing ammo, which I'm not too interested in, really. I'll just give it to Vic anyway. Alright. Simple enough. Oh my. That fucking hurt. That's weird. Um, Vic. Hey, buddy. Um, take that. Is there any different? I don't see any difference between these. That's, that's weird. Whatever. There's some different stacks. It looks really strange. Uh, let's uh, loot the place. The loot is mine for the taking. Guns and bullets, I'm not going to be using that. It's useless to me. Anything in the fridge? Nothing that I want. 
about these lockers. Stim packs I'll take. Uh, baton. Not worth not worth taking, I don't think. I mean, worth a few uh I'll take that for Sulik. Actually, I think those are both worth taking. Yeah. Uh, Sulik. Here you go, man. Take that. Take that. There you go. Happy man. Happy, happy guy. Is the door closed? Why'd you close the door? Um, what's in here? Uh, it's just a little pen or something. Got another guard? Is it the only guard out here? Uh, there's another guard over there. Three spaces. You best be running. <laughs> Lie down, shithead. Jeez. should have fucking saved. I don't think that's... I don't think that'll do anything bad, right? Fuck, Sulik. How the fuck did you do that? He just has no regard. You know what I mean? He just doesn't give a fuck. Uh... What, Jippy? I'd be needing you to be more careful where you fucking pray and... Oh, no, not you. You fucking pray and spray, man. You just fuck shit up, man. Uh, where the fuck is Vic? There he is. See his bald head sticking out there? Some more ammo for you, big guy. Alright. Let's unlock these. Wonder what's in here. Is this just the outhouse? Yeah, it's just the John. The John, the Lou. That's mission complete, man. Fucking right. A rawhide saloon. Uh, let me see if I can sell any of these weapons. This crazy looking dude over here. What do you got? Got ammo. That's what you got. Ammo for Sulik. Give me all of that. All of that good stuff. Uh. 
even that out. Um, maybe I wait 50, 60. So 30, I don't know, 45. Yeah, Sue would really fucking rip shit up with that that P90 man. What, Jippy? He's just a beast with that thing. Uh, he is a bit wild with it. Uh, but I guess he wouldn't be Sulik if he wasn't wild, right? Wild savage tribal that he is. Hey guys, you all right over there or what? Fucking hell. Uh, let me. Let me get into the car and then get back here, because they're fucking stuck. Go back in. There's another merchant in there, in the NCR, I think. And I am loaded up with a few guns, so I think I'm going to stop by and see what I can trade in. So look, I need you to wait here, man. Alright. We be here. Um Okay. So uh, I need you to wait here. Well Well uh yeah. I need you to wait here, Vic. Can you do that? Vic hasn't been, you know, I, I mentioned it before, but Vic, he has not been too bad this playthrough so far. He's He shot me a few times, he shot our companions a few times, but all in all, he hasn't been too bad. Right? Uh, I think the merchant is here. There's no sign in you know, Stockman's. Uh, buy. Metal Armor Mark II. You got, you got that. That's stuff that I would like. <laughs> How about this? Do you like that? How about this? Do you like that? Uh, you don't have enough. Uh, I sold the brass knuckles already. So I'll do this. Go ahead and get that ammo for our friend uh, Marcus because he just blows through that shit really fast. Uh, I need to talk to the sheriff here. Uh, sorry about your generator, but fuck, you know, what do you want? I'm not a fucking. I'm not the NCR police, man. I am not that guy. Uh... Deputy Carl. What can you tell me about your town? This is the NCR, capital of the New California Republic, population 3,000 and growing. No slavery, no gambling, no drugs. President is Mrs. Tandy. My boss is Sheriff Dumont. Can I answer all your questions? Yeah, that's all. No s Oops. Yeah, there, there goes the uh, power plant. Where's the sheriff? Where's the sheriff? Oh, 
Okay. Is he in here? I don't remember where the sheriff is. God damn it. Ah, uh, well. We'll just make our way down here, I reckon. I love the music here. The bass line. Great. I wonder what that is. It's gotta be some type of armory or something? Welcome to the Congress House. How can I help you? Looking for a job? That's nice. This isn't a hiring hall. Why don't you try downtown? What a fucking prick. Huh? Fucking hell. Where's the sheriff? Tell me where your sheriff is, goddammit. I got a few words for him. Did he die in the explosion? I don't think he did. Is he in the bar? Fuck. Uh, we can tell the rangers that we uh, freed the slaves. I've heard the news already. You freed the slaves. Good work. Is he ready to become a ranger? Yeah. Do you swear to fight slavery whenever the opportunity arises and to help your fellow ranger when they're in need? Yeah. Congratulations. You're now a ranger. It's your sworn duty to fight slavery wherever it may appear. Take care, my friend. Three thou. Uh, let me put my sunglasses on. Put those on. Afraid not much to do. Um... He didn't die, did he, the sheriff? He's got a scout handbook. Check that out. He's got weapons as well. Some psycho. Was he the sheriff? Electronics book. Uh, his, his name was Officer Jack. I don't think it was Sheriff Jack. Uh, okay. This town don't care for your kind, any trouble, and I come down hard now. Is there anything I can do for you? You must be the sheriff. Looking for honest work, can you help me? I think I got a couple of things if you're interested. Like what? Well, there's a Dupo at the Stockman's. He does the hiring for the Brahmin drives. Uh, then there's Mr. Weston, if you can if you talk to him. Tell him I sent you. Even President Tandy's been asking around for help. President Tandy? President of the NCR, who else? Things have got her so worried, she's even asked to borrow one of my deputies for a special mission. Hated to turn her down, but I can't spell, spare the manpower. How about me? Maybe you could recommend me. Hmm, you? I couldn't. Don't even know you, but she's looking to hire somebody so you can go talk to her yourself. Her office is in the Hall of Congress. Thanks, I'll do that. See if we can get in there now. Is 
The NCR is a heavily policed place, huh? Fucking police everywhere. Can you let me in? I'm here to see President Sandy concerning. I heard your president's got a job to be done. Oh, that. Talk to Mr. Gunther and back. Can I help you? I'm here to see President Tandy about a job. Ah, uh, yes, well, she's instructed me to send in anyone asking about it. You're buzzed in. It's the door to my right. I'm Tandy, President of the New California Republic. Welcome to Shady Sands. I hear some pretty impressive things about you. No point in dancing. Got some business I want to discuss. Um, if you have played the original Fallout, you will know that this is, in fact, the Tandy from Shady Sands. My God, look how old she is now, right? Um, <clears throat> uh, her voice actor, or actress, is also, like all the talking heads in uh, the first two Fallout games, uh, have done extra work, you know, in cartoons, shows, various things like that. Uh, I, I don't know their names. I'm not good with, with actors and actresses' names, you know. Uh, so you can look it up for yourself. I'm sure uh, the lady who did the voice acting for Tandy here uh, has definitely done uh, other work. Uh, one second here. I got to put something on here. Forgot about. I think that's it. Okay, that's that's better. All right. Let me adjust my position here. Okay. Fine. What can I do for you? We need some computer parts from our old base, Bolt 15. Problem is, there's squatters there who won't let anybody buy. Somebody has to convince them to let us in, or just bring back the parts. You up for the job? I'm interested, but what's the job pay? It's all business, huh? Fine. 500 when it's done. I don't haggle, so take it or don't waste my time. I'll take it, but I need some information. Well, I got a little time to spare. What can you tell me about Vault 15? It's just east of here, an underground shelter from the war. Most families in NCR came from it, so it's rightfully ours. Go on. A couple of years ago, some squatters moved in and built a shanty town on the surface. They call it the Squat. They're nothing but dogs in the manger. They can't get into the vault, but they keep us out. I see. I need to ask you about some few other things. What do you want to know? Do you know where Vault 13 is? Vault 13? Why are you asking? I'm the chosen one of my village. I am a descendant of the Vault Dweller. You're serious, aren't you? If we're talking about the same person, he saved my life. <laughs> then vanished. When I start thinking it was only a dream, I go look at the statue out front. Statue? That's right. For scaring off the raiders. They kept clear of Shady Sands afterwards, and we got time to get ourselves set up. We made him a hero, even if we didn't believe a word about him coming from Vault 13. My dad and Seth searched for years trying to find Vault 13. They died looking. Always said it was west of here. If somebody were to find Vault 13, that'd do us even better than 15. I'll keep that in mind. Can I ask you some more? What do you want to know? Uh, why haven't you made a deal with the squatters? I tried. I sent some people down there, but after the first few, they stopped coming back. I can't prove the squatters are responsible either. My boys managed to capture one of them, but he won't talk. Got them locked up downtown. A few more questions, please. Get to it. I can't spend the day with you. I'll try to be quick. What do you want to know? I'm looking for a geck. Would you happen to have one? A geck? Like the lizard? We got them all over. No, no, not the damn lizards. Never mind, I need to ask you something else. What do you want to know? Um... The Elder tells a story about the Vault Dweller and someone named Tandy. Are you that Tandy? Lord, that was a long time ago. Hardly remember who I was then. Just a naive girl. The one you call the Vault Dweller. Is he still alive? 
The Vault Dweller is my ancestor. He lives on in me. Yeah. There's a resemblance. You've got the same fire, too. I was always afraid that he was nothing but a skeleton somewhere in the desert. I'd like to hear your story. Figures. Well, I was pretty young when we met. There was a gang of raiders, the cons, who had gotten hold of me. Things were looking pretty bad when all of a sudden this stranger shows up and rescues me. Your vault dweller. The vault, uh, the vault dweller had many such adventures. I used to envy him that. I wanted a life of adventure, but I stayed here and took over as mayor when my dad died. Been running this place and building NCR ever since. Guess it turned out to be a pretty big life after all. The Elder will be happy to know that you are still alive. I'm sorry, but I need to know more. Get to it. I can't spit. What do you want to Don't you get snappy with me, old woman. Uh, is this the Shady Sands the Elder speaks of? Was Shady Sands. Most folks call it NCR now. New California Republic. Pretty impressive name, huh? Tell me about the NCR, please. Lord, I could talk about that forever, and I just don't have the time. Here's a holodisc on the NCR. We make them to spread the good word. Uh, thanks. What do you want to know? I think that's all I need to know. I'll be going. Alright, so we have a new uh, objective from Tandy. Here's a statue of the Vault Dweller. Um, there's a plaque at the base. It reads, To the stranger in Vault 13, what doesn't exist. Uh, we must uh, sometimes dream and let our dreams inspire us to greater heights. So it was with the stranger and his belief in the legend of Vault 13. I don't know why they don't believe the fucking guy that he, was, he wasn't from Vault 13 because... I mean, he only wore a fucking suit with 13 on the back of it when he came to Shady Sands. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, why didn't they believe him that he was from Vault 13? Okay. Whatever. Let's equip our laser rifle. What you be need? Let's go, Sulek. We got stuff to do. What you be Yes, we do. What's up? You... Yeah, it's a peaceful town, right? But all the fucking cops carry fucking are fucking armed to the teeth, right? Uh, Vic, there's Vic. Let's go. That's it. Let's go. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, I got stuff for you. What do you want? You want some stuff? No, that's not for you. That's for you. And that's for you. Alright, happy? Happy big guy? I'm glad. Let's get going. Uh, let me read these. And the scout handbook as well. Give, uh, ammo to Vic. Vic's got plenty of ammo now, huh? Look at that. He's not going to be needing ammo for quite some time, right? I think Marcus could use some stim packs. Uh, he, he used quite a what few in the Wanamingo mine. Uh, how many stims do you have, too? I'll give you some more. You're usually on the front line. Uh, I got fucking 33 anyway. I'll give you four. You are important to me, Marcus. That's why I bought you that, that three thousand uh three thousand dollar armor. Yes it is. Okay. Save the game here. Get in the car. Get in the car. And let's go to Vault fifteen, everybody. I hope the car doesn't glitch out there. Okay, it is still there. A cluster of dirty tents and shacks hug, uh, hug a wooded hillside 
The people you see are lean and wary. Well, let's go ahead and rest till morning so I can see. That would be helpful. Oh my. What the fuck happened to him? <laughs> what the fuck was that about? Alright, anyway, uh... There are a few people we need to talk to here. Nobody in there. I think it's the shack here. No, that's the that's the John there. Uh, I think it's that building there. Uh, yeah, right. an older squatter. My name's Zeke, stranger. I'm sorry, but I don't have time to talk to you, and I don't think there's anything in this town for you anyway. You should move on. Just wanted to ask a couple of questions. I think you'll find uh, we're all out of answers here. Why don't you come back when we get a shipment in? A shipment? What kind of shipment? Talk to this older woman here. Hi, I'm Rebecca. Can we talk privately, please? What do you want to talk to me about? My daughter is missing, and I need help finding her. Can't talk about it here, though. Can we go somewhere private? All right, let's go. Thanks. We can go into my tent. We should be able to talk here. I have some questions for you first. What do you want to know? What's going on around here? We call this place the Squat because it was settled by the homeless of many cities. It's not much, but it's all we have. To the west is a city called the NCR. They've known about us for quite some time and never offered us any kind of help or hindrance. Now they are suddenly claiming this area as their ancestral home. And they want it back. They keep sending people here to try to talk to us out of our home, but they don't understand that we have nowhere else to go. We don't have the skills necessary to survive on our own if we leave here. Uh, what is here that they want so badly? Well, there is a vault here. I think it's number 15. They want to loot it for any of the old technology that may still be there. Uh -huh. That explains a lot. You've been very helpful. I need to ask you some more questions. I'm looking for vault 13. Do you know anything about it? Sorry, I have no idea. I would ask about it in the NCR. Uh, they've taken a great interest in Vault lately. All right, I will. Who's in charge? That would be Zeke. He runs everything up here. You can find him in the building over there. It points northeast. All right. Uh, let's talk about your problem now. I have a daughter named Chrissy, who is a bit of a tomboy. She likes to run around, explore, and pretty much stick her nose into things. Chrissy's a good kid, though. Uh, where was I? Uh, she doesn't cause trouble. She's always home on time, and she's shown herself to be a very reasonable young lady. A responsible young lady. I let her do as she pleases most of the time. Last week, Chrissy didn't come home. I've asked around, and nobody's seen or heard from her. I tried to find her myself, but Zeke, he's sort of the mayor here. Uh, stopped me. He said it wasn't safe for me to go out looking on my own. He'd have some of his men do it. They couldn't find her either, and said that maybe the slavers got her. I can't explain why, but I don't believe the slavers took her. I have an I have an uneasy feeling that something else is going on, and then there's this feeling uh, that something else is going on, and then there's this feeling that I'm being followed. I've had it ever since I talked to Zeke about Chrissy. I need someone to help me find my daughter. Will you help me, please? All right, I'll help you. Thank you so much. Never been able to. I'll never be able to repay you for this. I'm wait here until you bring. Hey, there was someone outside listening to us. I saw the shadow in the tent wall. Uh, they just ran off uh, th that way. Went to northeast. They must have heard something. I'll try and stop them. I don't have much health. I'm kind of worried about that, but I think I'll be okay. I'm Dahlia. What can I help you with? Did you see someone go by here in a hurry? I see people go by here every day. I don't really much pay attention to them. 
Look, a young girl's life is at stake here. The daughter of a worried mother. Can you help me out with that? I don't give a rat's ass. I'm sorry. I'm just a gun who was hired to stand here and guard this trail. Other than that, I don't know what's going on around here. I had a daughter once. Though, and yeah. Some guy went by here. I let him through because he knew the proper sign, just like the sign you gave me. Go on. I'm out of here. I should shoot you dead, but I'm kind of curious about what you sh you could possibly have to say for me. Looking for a missing girl, seen her? I mean, the one locked up in the back that we've been having fun with? Nah, I haven't seen her. <laughs> uh, Rick uh, doesn't like kidnappings, slavery, or anything like that. Uh, uh, hand over the girl and we can all leave here alive. Why the hell should I do that? Because I'm the worst thing that you could ever fear happening to you. Hand her over or feel the pain. That sounds like a challenge. I'll take it. <laughs> Retreat! Hey, guy. Come on. Come back. Ah! Wow, I don't know what happened there. I've never seen them run away like that before. Or him, at least. Nice. Get him. Don't let him get away. Uh, he's wearing, uh, that's right, uh, fucking, uh, metal armor is more effective against, uh, where's my, is that my 22, or 223, yeah. uh, they are, uh, more effective against, uh, uh, well, they protect you better from, uh, energy weapons, so, that's something to note. Spike Knuckles, I'll definitely take those. So worth quite a bit. I'll take that. Uh, I'll take the key as well. Fuck it. Let's take everything. What about that? Uh, you have a sniper rifle. Nice. That is what I have been needing for quite some time. Hey, uh... What's up? Cassidy. Take that. I can take that as a gun. Alright. Let's go. We might actually be able to do uh, that Mordino quest. Not, not Mordino, the right quest. What we got in here, huh? Sledgehammer, nothing useful. Flares. Yeah, basically nothing I want. Right. Ah, fuck it. I'll give the lockpick a try. Yeah. Nice. Ooh, there's a trap there. That's nasty. If you're here to try to rape me, you're gonna get. Uh, you're gonna be wearing your balls as a bow tie. Get it? I'd like to know who you are and what's going on here. In a nutshell, my name is Chrissy, and I'm from the squat. I was out exploring last week when I found that the entrance uh, when I found the entrance out here. I thought it might be an abandoned mine or something, so I decided to check it out. Well, it's not a mine; it's a secret entrance into Vault 15. The vault is being used as a base for a band of raiders called the Cons. They caught me snooping around, and their leader, Darian, had locked me up here. Uh, the people of the squat are protecting these guys. Helping them keep the vault a secret, but they don't know what's really going on here. Darian told us that the vault was being repaired so we could have a safe place to live with lots of food and water. But it's all a lie. 
I've been in here and looked around. The vault is dead and the food and water machines don't work. Our food and water's been coming from the spoils of raids against caravans. Look, I've got to get home and warn everyone about what's really going on here. Uh, we can't help these monsters. Will you take me home? All right, let's go. Woo! Where is her tent? Ah, that's her tent. You saved my daughter and I can never repay you for your kindness. Thank you. Please wait here. I need to talk with Chrissy. And then I'll talk to you. Alright. My daughter has told me everything. I find it hard to believe that Darian is such a monster after all he's been doing for us. And to think we've been helping him hide his operations as a razor. I can guarantee you we won't stand for it any longer. I've already talked to Zeke and he wants to see you. Let's go see him now. Hey, level up. Nice. Uh, let's put some more points into energy weapons, eh? Get that up to 100, please. Alright, I'm up to 100 in energy weapons. Sweet. Yes. Rebecca has told me uh, what you did for her. I want to apologize for the treatment you received here. You certainly didn't deserve it. What can I help you with? I got some questions. You work for Darian? Yes, I do. I act as the middleman between him and the people up here. I'm not very happy about the fact now that I know what he's up to, I see. Uh, what do you intend to do about the raiders? Nothing. They have the guns, the control, and the water. And they control the food. That means they are in charge, period. We have no skills and no means of support without the backing of Darian. That can be turned against him. We're at his mercy. Would you consider making a deal with the NCR? That all depends. What did you have in mind? Join the NCR, let them annex your territory, and give them access to the vault. In return, they can teach you all the skills you need to survive on your own and offer you their protection. Not bad. I like it. You've got yourself a deal if you can get the NCR to agree with it as well. But look, someone has to take care of Darian and his cronies. It should be done now before they realize what has happened and have time to prepare for an attack. Why not get this over with and take, uh, take out Darian now? You'll have the element of surprise on your side. Yeah, I guess that's how it has to be done. Um, I guess uh, I guess that's it. Wait, before you go, I found this key card some time ago. I have no idea what it's for. Rebecca says that we found some sort of entrance where they were holding Chrissy. Maybe this card will open it. Here, take it. Thanks. Let's go back to the car. Ah, cram some of this shit that I have in there. I don't think I'm going to be needing the uh, 223 pistol anymore, so I'm going to put that in the trunk. Put all this stuff in the trunk. All this stuff in the trunk. You want to get in there. Desert Eagles. Alright. Uh, let's do some first aid see if I can heal myself the strain might kill you I always found that a really weird statement the strain might kill you it's just like what? how much okay I still have plenty of ammo for the sniper rifle that's good I don't think I'll be needing the sunglasses, so I'll just put that in there. Let's go. We ride forth. Save the game here. Go down. I said go down.
All right, as you can see here, we are now in Vault 15. Oh yeah, Vault 15. The memories. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna leave this for next episode, uh, and and next time we are going to be well, basically killing anything that moves in Vault 15. Uh, Rix doesn't take kindly to raiders. And yeah, so until next time, thank you for watching.